Hi guys, I'm back after like three weeks or something. Sorry, it's taking me so long. I know I'm like backed up on requests and everything, but I've been so busy with school and uh, I just, I hope you all understand. Um, so today what I did is a purple smoky eye. It was a request, it was like one of the first requests I got um, along with the rainbow and the pink and coral and brown. So this one is really fast actually. It was like one of the fastest ones I've done so far. So keep watching because it's really pretty and just super easy that anyone can do. Okay. Okay. I decided that it would probably be a good idea if I started listing the products that I used before I did the makeup. So for this, what you're going to need is a light purple, kind of medium purple eyeshadow. A light silvery white color. A sparkly black and a dark purple like a very deep plum color and then I'm just gonna use pink blush and for the lip gloss it's Love Nectar by MAC best lip gloss ever okay so first what I did is I put on Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion all over my whole lid in the corner and under my eye so next what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the light purple medium purple eyeshadow the one I'm using is Mika Bella. It's called Nuisance. And I'm going to get that and put it on my whole lid. Going from the inner corner to the outer corner. So right now it should look just like this. Next I'm going to get this light silvery white-ish color. The color I'm using is Jewel. It's a Vincent Longo eyeshadow, but again, don't use the eyeshadows I use. And I'm going to put it in the corner of my eye, right here. And then I'm also going to put it on top of this purple one, a tiny bit leading up towards the middle of my eye, to about right here. And I'm going to blend it really well. That way, you can't tell that I put it on top of it. It just looks like it's lighter right there. Now I'm going to get this sparkly black color. There's one by HIP or HIP um, that you can get at like Walgreens or CVS or something. And I'm going to get it on my finger and put it in the very outer corner of my upper lid. Now I'm going to get this dark purple. It's called Soul Sister by ID Bare Minerals. And this is my favorite one that I'm using today. It's so pretty. It's actually my mom's, but I love it so much that I stole it from her. And I'm going to put this color on top of the black and also leading up into the crease. I'm going to take a slanted eyeshadow brush well, eyeliner brush. And I'm going to line the top and bottom eyelids along my lash line with this dark purple color again. So after I do the top, then I'm just going to go along the whole bottom. And when you do this, you want to make sure that right here, in the very corner of your eye, the top and bottom connect. You don't want an empty space like right there. Okay, so that's it for the eyeshadow. Next, what I'm going to do is put on some blush. And I'm going to start right here, like on the biggest part of my cheekbone. Blend it outward and inward, down a little and up a little. And then I'm also going to blend it on my temple and on my chin a tiny bit. Now I'm going to curl my eyelashes and put on mascara. So to curl your eyelashes, you want to make sure you get all of them 
in the eyelash curler and squeeze it at the roots then keep squeezing it all the way to the tips so now my eyelashes are curled as you can see and I'm going to put on colossal mascara so the way I do this is I put it on the very tips of my eyelashes first and I do it in like a side to side motion I'll kind of keep going back and forth on them from the inner corner to the outer corner and then once I get to the outer corner I need to go with the very very roots Then I'm going to go back over my eyelashes, going from the roots to the tips. And now they're done. And lastly, I'm going to put on lip gloss. Look at my finger. I went out to eat last night and I cut it with a knife like really deep. I don't know if I have to get stitches yet, um, but I might. I've never gotten stitches or anything, so I'm kind of scared. But back to the makeup. Okay, so I'm using this lip gloss and I'm going to focus it mainly in the middle of my lips because you don't want it to look too gloppy or anything. And then you can kind of spread it to the outer corners. And that's it. So now you can take your hair down and whatever, you know. There's your look. Smoky purple eyes. And that's all. It was really easy. So I hope that, you know, you got all you wanted out of your requests and everything.